Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to get the Windows Vista Start menu for XP. And I personally like it a lot because you can do the start search where you search your programs and stuff, which let's search Adobe. And there's all my Adobe stuff. I can search, uh, I don't know, whatever I want really. Anything that I have, like Snagit. There we go. Um, what else do I have in here? Audacity. There it is. Okay. So there you go. You have your built-in start menu search guy. You click back, and you're back to your regular well start menu. Okay. It just looks not a lot nicer because it uh, has the nice transparent look and everything. And today I'm going to show you how to get it the way I got it. And I can tell you this works flawlessly because I've done it. You guys have seen me use it. And okay, first thing you want to do is go into the description of this video on this YouTube video, and you'll see a link guiding to here. This way, you don't have to type all this in, just click a link, and you're there. Next thing you want to do is click download. Boom. Not a very big file, not big at all, actually. 322 kilobytes. Not big. Uh, you can exit your browser now, and you'll come up with something like this. Okay, this right here is actually a WinRAR WinZip file. Double click it to open it and you'll come up with a few files. Um, I'm just going to extract the main one, the executable. Okay, I'm going to extract it. It's right there. Alright, the next thing you want to do is personally, I don't have to do this because I already have it installed and everything, but just double click this and it'll run the installer or it'll start up, whatever. Um, some box should come up right here in the middle of your screen saying, yo, it's starting up, bomb, yada yada. You know, kind of like a little splash screen in the beginning of programs. You know how they come up like in the beginning of Sony Vegas, the Sony Vegas thing pops up in the beginning of uh, Adobe products, the Adobe the, bleh, the Adobe thing pops up. Um, you know, just stuff like that. So there you go. Um, after it starts up, you should see your taskbar icon down here in the bottom right. Um, right here. You have a few options for it, so go ahead and check that out. Um, yeah. So this works perfectly um, for me. It has if you have any problems with it, go ahead and message me through YouTube, and I'll see what I can do to help you out. Okay, so remember, it's in beta, so it might have some bugs, but like I said, and I keep saying, it's worked flawlessly for me. Thanks for watching this video. Pretty quick, pretty simple. Um, look forward to my upcoming videos. If you want, make a response video of what your whole setup looks like, your desktop, what your uh, taskbar looks like and show me that beautiful Windows Vista start menu, okay? So uh, make a response video, comment on, comment on this video, rate it five stars if you liked it, one star if you hated it. Um, okay, thanks a lot, subscribe to me, bye.